First check of your pinpoint weather alert, 12 this noontime. A smoky haze over southern New England this morning as we're under an air quality alert. The smoke in the skies originating in Quebec and Ontario and fires there. At this hour, a live look outside you're seeing here over the city from our Kettle Point camera as the conditions continue today for respiratory concerns. Good afternoon, I'm Kate Walsh. We have team coverage in Providence and meteorologist TJ Del Santo is here tracking the smoke conditions. Thicker and more intense perhaps than last week when we saw the smoke from Nova Scotia's wildfires today, right? Yeah, you can definitely smell it outside. Mm -hmm. I just took a, a quick whiff outside <laughs> and you could definitely smell that campfire smell. And at times it could easily be uh, worse than what we had for a short period of time last week. This one will continue through the afternoon and into the evening hours. And you can clearly see that haze and uh, smoke in the sky this morning or this afternoon. Air quality alert in effect as we head through the afternoon. It's actually in effect till midnight tonight. Poor air quality. And again, yeah, if you have a respiratory ailment such as asthma, good idea is just to stay indoors and close the windows. Temperatures upper 60s to around 70 degrees. So it is a little warmer today. There's some good Good news this afternoon temperatures will be climbing into the low 70s and we also have the chance for a couple of showers and maybe an isolated thunderstorm as we go through the afternoon as well we'll be talking more about that a lot more about the uh, haze in the air coming up in just a little while now live team coverage continues from providence 12 news reporter sheena loshudo just talked to experts at the rhode island department of environmental management to get updates for us on what we need to know sheena how is it out there well right now Smell that smoke here in Providence. Now, no matter what's burning, health officials say you never want to breathe in that smoke, right? Again, here in Providence, that skyline behind me, not as clear as it usually is. We've been driving around taking some video for you. Take a look at this. We saw a similar site last Tuesday, but according to state officials, the hazy and smoky conditions that we're seeing right now are expected to last a lot longer. TJ also just touched on that. And of course, this all ties back to the wildfire in Quebec, the smoke really moving toward our way right now. The message from the Rhode Island De Department of Environmental Management and the Health Department is to really just keep those windows closed at home and try to stay inside if you can, especially if you have any underlying respiratory conditions. Be aware and kind of self-aware of how you're feeling. And if you're not feeling great and you're going on a run outside, it's okay to say, yeah, it's the weather's not, you know, the the air quality is not great. So perhaps it, it would be better to take it easy. Now, smoky and gloomy is really just how we would describe these conditions we're seeing outside right now. State officials say the air quality is considered unhealthy, even if you don't have any medical conditions, any underlying conditions. But if you're outside, if you're really feeling it, they say a N95 mask can potentially help you with that. For now, reporting live in Providence, I'm Sheena Loshudo, 12 News.